Goes back for our purposes, Mr. Stubbe, seek recognition. Uh, move to strike the last word, Mr. Chair. Gentleman is recognized. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. And I would uh, yield to a member on the Democratic side that served in a combat area designated zone uh, and deployment of our country. Anybody in the Democratic side? Mr. Stubbe, what's the purpose of the question? My father, my father. I, no, 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 let me finish. No, let no, me finish. Because because I, I'm going to make a point and you're taking my time. So I will yield I to any member who Because deployed. I'm offended to see, at your suggestion that somehow if we've not served okay. in a combat zone, that we don't care about protecting the lives of our constituents. Has nothing That's to do why I'm responding. To me, and for our family members who have lost Mr. blood, time. they should be responding. Reclaiming my time. So, no, Mr. Chairman, I'd like me. 40 seconds I've seen back my constituents die in battle. It's Mr. Stubbe's time. Gentleman is recognized. And I will ask for 40 additional seconds that I was taken. Okay, so I, I served in Operation Iraqi Freedom. I served in the Army, and there's a lot of talk in Washington about weapons of war. And my purpose uh, of yielding to one of my colleagues who may have served uh, was to ask them a specific question of what type of firearm were you issued when you were deployed? And the answer to that question is a true what would be defined as a weapon actually used in war, has a selector switch on it for fully automatic, three-round burst, and semi-automatic. So when I deployed in 2006 in Operation Iraqi Freedom, we were issued M4s in the United States Army. Those M4s had a selector switch on them. Those selector switch allow you to have fully automatic, three-round burst, or semi-automatic. Those firearms are not allowed for purchase in the United States today. So these, this, this, cascading of weapons of war, what I was issued, and again, I would ask any person that served in a deployed environment, you are issued weapons that allow for fully automatic and three round bursts. That is not available for purchase in the United States, and that is not what the Democrats are attempting to ban today because that's already banned.